What's up, Betting Edge Wizards? Well, it is week 15 in the NFL, and this is where things get really serious, including us. we got three more great free picks for you. Let's get right into the action. Packers! Chiefs! All right, the in-spin simulator made the points for in this game, the Packers minus 10. Boy, are they on a roll. There is tremendous value betting the Chiefs at plus 14.5 or better. This is right now listed on inspin.com as a two-star free pick. The Chiefs are going to face the Packers this weekend with a new head coach calling the shots. Todd Haley's comment was fired after a very tough 37-10 loss to the Jets, which dropped KC to 5-8 and eight on the year after going to the playoffs last year. He's been replaced on an interim basis with Romeo Cornell. Name sound familiar? He assumed all the duties this past week. Change is good in the NFL, and I feel players will respond this week to the new head coach. Cornell has expressed he is very interested in turning this into a permanent head coach position. How can he accomplish that? Simple. Winning. Here's a quote for you. I would like to be a head coach again and show that I can get it done, said Cornell, who is 24 and 40 in four seasons with the Cleveland Browns. I know how to get it done, and I think the experience from the first time will make me better the next time around. He expressed his desire this week to start either Kyle Orton or Ricky Stanzi in place of the ineffective Tyra Palco. The laws continue to run the defense in order to keep a little continuity as they finish out the season. Take a look at the line right now at WagerWeb.com. WagerWeb has the line at Packers 13 and a half. However, 90% of the betting action has been on the favorite. So wait until the game goes up to 14 or better. Also, if you open an account with WagerWeb.com this week and mention Dan the Man or InSpin, they will honor your first bet at Chiefs plus 14 and a half. That's a full free point on your first bet. Got to love that. Here's a tasty betting trend from InSpin.com's database. These trends are so tasty, you can eat them all day. Sign up for Free Insider, by the way, and get all these betting trends each and every day for absolutely nothing. Chiefs are 5-1 and one against the spread of their last six games as a home underdog. It's an 83% winner. Expect the Chiefs to come out home re-energized. It has been a difficult year filled with injuries and disappointment, but this weekend is going to be different. They're going to play hard enough to impress their new interim coach and do just enough to cover the 14.5-point spread versus a Packers team more interested in staying healthy than undefeated. Take the 14.5 and, and bake it this weekend at Arrowhead. Panthers, Texans. It's been similar to me the points spread in this game. Texans minus three. There is value betting the Panthers at seven or better. This is listed right now on Instagram.com as a two-star free pick. The Houston Texans are on George Harrison's cloud nine right now after locking up the first playoff spot in franchise history. What does that mean for this weekend? It means let down. Take a look at the 49ers game last weekend for a little perspective on the situation. San Francisco locked up a playoff spot the week before, and what happened next? They lost 21-19 to to the 5-7 and seven Cardiac Cardinals. Letdown after such an emotional win happens with young, inexperienced teams. The same will happen this weekend with the Texans. Take a look at the line at wagerweb.com. As the Texans listed at 6 Open an account with them this week and mention in spin or Dan the Man, and they will honor your first bet at plus seven on the Panthers. It's a free key number, full point on your first bet. Houston defensive guru Wade Wilson Phillips will be absent for the first time all season. He also won't be able to turn out the head. This will have an impact on players who will be lethargic after locking up that elusive playoff spot. Also, I am not 100% sold on General TJ Yates who has not proven he can be consistent week in and week out. Expect a Texas-sized letdown of epic proportions. Panthers plus seven are a live dog, so bet him and bake him this weekend at Reliance Stadium. Titans, Colts. The instant similarity to the spread of this game, Titans minus three. There's a lot of value betting the Colts at plus seven and a half or better. This is listed right now on Instant.com as a two-star free pick. The Colts have started quarterback Dan Orlovsky, the Connecticut Miracle, and have covered against the spread the past two games. Let's take a look. Week 13 versus the Pats. Lose 31-24, but cover the 21-point spread. Week 14 versus the Ravens. Quote them nevermore. Lose 24-10, but cover the 60-point spread. Two of the best teams in the NFL. Bookmakers make odds based on statistics, which work for the most part. However, there are situations and intangibles that often come into play which can generate good value in betting. This game is the perfect example of those intangibles marrying together. The Colts do not want to become the second team in NFL history, my Detroit Lions, to lose all 16 games in a single season. Players have a lot of pride, and it is embarrassing for this team to be the laughing stock of the NFL after so many seasons at the top. Here's some quotes to consider. 
quarterback Dan Orlovsky. Losing stinks, no matter what it is, whether it's football, if it's rock, paper, scissors. None of us like to lose. There's nothing fun about losing. By the way, I was the number four ranked rock, paper, scissors player in all of North America in 2008. Coach Coach Jim Caldwell said, we need to find a way to get our team better so we can get a victory. And not just one. We're running out of time. Let's take a look right now at the line at wagerweb.com. They have the spread listed as the Titans minus six and a half. Don't forget to open an account with them this week and mention inspin.com or Dan the Man, and they will honor your first bet on the Colts plus seven and a half. That's a free key number, full point on your first bet. Expect the spirited Colts team to show up this weekend at home. The players are angry, and this is their best opportunity left for a much-needed home win this year. The suck for luck is all but guaranteed, and they cannot focus on winning at least one game. Tennessee may have to go with Jake Locker this weekend if Hasselbeck's calf injury doesn't improve. However, if Hasselbeck does play, he will not be 100%, and the Colts will benefit either way. Take the 7.5 on the Colts at wagerup.com, and Indy is a live dog the rest of the season. So big it this weekend at Lucas Oil Stadium. There you go. Three picks, three winners, the Chefs plus 14.5, the Panthers plus 7, the Colts plus 7.5. you got to believe in that. The holidays are upon us, and I'm always here for you each and every week on NFL 3 for free. For the betting edge, I'm Dan the Man. Until next time, believe in the holiday dream. And don't forget to sign up for Insider Now. Get all the two-star free plays.